Hello, my name is Quinton from LeafCloud, and today I want to show you how to log into OpenStack using the command line interface. So to start off, you want to go to docs.leaf.cloud, and here you want to go to getting started using the OpenStack CLI, and you're going to want to copy this command. Then you're going to open your terminal paste the command and fill in your password and then uh, this way you're going to install the OpenStack CLI. Here, now we're done and now we've installed the OpenStack CLI. Now you want to go to your leaf cloud environment create.leaf.cloud you want to log in then go to the user on the top right and then download the OpenStack RC file. Then we'll open it and place it in the correct folder. Now I've placed it in the correct folder. Now to log into OpenStack, you wanna open a new terminal and type in source and then the location you saved the demo file. Here you'll have to type in the password from your OpenStack account. So that's also the password you use to log in to create that leaf.cloud. Now we've logged into OpenStack. So the next thing we're going to do is create a server using the command line interface. So to do this, we'll start off by creating a key pair. We'll type OpenStack key pair create. And we'll call it CLI key pair. There you go. We've created the key pair. If you want to see all your available key pairs, you can do this by typing open stack key pair list. And here you can see all the key pairs that I've made. If you want to choose an image and you don't know all the images, you can also type open stack image list and you'll see all the images or you can type open stack flavor list to see all the available flavors. There you go. So now I've started a new terminal and we're going to create the server. If you want to log into OpenStack, uh, which is required to work from OpenStack, you have to type in source and then the directory to a demo file to log in every time. There you go. And of course, you have to log in using your OpenStack password. Okay, so now that we're logged in, you want to type OpenStack server. And then we'll use um, server create, and then we'll call it CLI test. Then you can choose image. And if you don't know which image to choose, you can of course uh, log in again, enter your password again, and then type open stack image list. And then you can choose your image. We'll choose this version of Ubuntu. And we'll go here. And we'll paste it. Then next, we'll choose our flavor. And for this, we can go to the other terminal again. Uh, there we go. And we'll choose open stack flavor list. And then we'll see all the flavors. And then we'll choose uh, the flavor we'd like to use, which is this one. Here we go. Okay, and next we're going to choose our key pair. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, you have to type in key name. And we'll choose the key pair we just made, which is CLI key pair. And then last but not least, we'll choose our network, which is just public. There we go. Oh, I'm sorry. 
the network public is not available, but we do have a network external, which is the public network. There we go. Now we've launched our instance. If we go back to the instance overview in the web interface, you'll see the CLI test instance that we just created using the command line interface. So in this tutorial, we've created a server using the OpenStack CLI. We've learned to work with the OpenStack CLI. We've downloaded the OpenStack CLI. Uh, so now you can uh, launch instances using your, uh, your command line interface. And if you have any other questions, uh, you can just leave them in the comments and we'll try our best to answer them. Bye.